So welcome back aliens. In the last video we have talked about how can you mix Java and Kotlin together. But there's one trick there. So since I have done that before in my system, it was working. It may happen that if you are doing this for the first time, you have to add the Kotlin support for your project or maybe Java support for your, I mean your Kotlin support for your project. So in fact, uh, I, I have created the Kotlin project, right? But then in case if you are getting some error, uh, once you create your Kotlin file, if you get an error, there will be an option of configure here. Okay, so on the top of this, there will be an option of configure. You just have to configure it and it, you have to select all modules. It will give you three options out of that. You have to select all modules and click on OK. Everything will be fine. Okay, so if you are getting some issues, let me know in the comment section if you are getting the problem with the configure there. But then we have one more trick in, 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 in IntelliJ which I want to show you here. So this class, which is alien, this is a class where you have, this is Java code, right? So let's say you have written a Java code and later you want a Kotlin code of this. Can you convert a Java code into Kotlin? I mean, we can, as, a, as programmers, can IntelliJ can convert that. It's, it's, it's actually possible. So just select your class and go to the code menu there. You can see down, down here, we got an option which is convert Java file to Kotlin file. And let's try this. If you click on this, it will say, okay, uh, I don't have any problem with that. And the moment you do that, can you see that it is changed? You got a class called as alien and we got a variable name, which is of type string and the default value is null. And this is a Kotlin code now. And this is your class, which is also alien.kt now. There's no more Java code. This is a Kotlin code. So you can write a big code and you can convert that code into Kotlin. It's that efficient. And that's why I love to use IntelliJ platform. So yeah, that's it from this video. In the, in the next video, we'll talk about more topics. So before that, do subscribe and share this video, share these videos with your friends if you're liking these videos. And do know, do do let me know your feedback on these videos. So that's it. Thanks so much for watching and do subscribe.